Scotland, uh, <laughs> to the station. I'm standing right beside Margaret Barton, who played the little girl Beryl in the refreshment room of Brief Encounter, the famous Brief Encounter film. She's uh, wonderfully come down all the way from Wimborne, Dorset, to uh, be with us on this very, very memorable occasion. And I think the turnout, I don't think it's all for the fine Scots, but I think she's, Paul Summer, is absolutely <laughs> marvellous. <laughs> us and uh, with his presence and his signing his new books and a commemorative card inside the station if uh, any of you would like yeah, one we'll, please come we'll, in we'll, after we'll, 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 Bill you would like to say something thank you ladies and gentlemen I'd just like to say that you won't be allowed out of the station today <laughs> until all the books are sold <laughs> <laughs> and I mean that because I can get very very nasty when I'm on the way but we are going back in there again to, to sign some more uh, so we have to see you in a moment. The, the, obviously the clock goes to uh, the day before the marvellous way that he, that he does this station. I mean, he just does it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's got a yeah. 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 oh, yeah. 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 very happy to see my daughter here, Margaret. It's wonderful. Marvellous. And she's going to say just a quick word to you. It's very exciting to be here and to think that the film was made 50 years ago and that it is still popular. Do you know there's a cinema in Tokyo which has been showing the film for 25 years? Do you think we're adapting to Japanese or are there subtitles on here? I have no idea. Anyway, it's very, very exciting to be here. Thank you all for being here. It's a wonderful occasion to see the train come through. I've been a train fan for years. Thank you very much, David. One particular is the World Trade, which was done up on the North North Railway. Yes, I mean, I, I'm not a railway fan. I'm, I'm, I like railway stations. And uh, that's why I'm so, you know, cross uh, that uh, they're now being left to, I mean, just to call them to this one. It's prepared all over the place. And, and I can't understand it when they say, oh, we've got to close our station, we've got to graffiti and so forth. Well, but, 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 there's only youngsters doing the graffiti, because there was people on the station from man them, as they used to be, then they, the station would be looked after automatically, because there was a station staff who still liked the station. I mean, I know one station, this is actually true, down in the south east, which in fact they closed the station, although the train stopped, they closed it. Because they say, oh no, the people are defeated, we don't want our, our station to face. And somebody had to lift the disabled person over the railings to catch a train. Now, this to me, in this day and age, is the most disgraceful behaviour of any railway company. I mean, I think our railway system is, 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 is written, not just because it's written with loose and crap, but I mean, the fact is this has been going on for some time, and it's got to be stopped. Well, Bill, enjoy the rest of your day here, and we're looking forward to see the Flying Scotsman come for any minute. Thanks for joining us. Thank you. Thank you very much. Nice to see you. Uh,